Why are termites such a problem and how much damage can they do? Action Pest Scott Robbins has the answers to those questions and so many more. Good to see you again. Thanks, Angie. Happy New Year. Happy New Year to you. So why, I mean, we, termites, you have termite infestation in your home. Why do they do so much damage? Well, the first thing is that people just don't realize they're there. You know, we people think they have a termite problem whenever the swarmers come out, but that's not really your first sign. Those termites, uh, that colony's been there developing for four, possibly five years before those winged reproductives come out. And secondly, they're, they're under the ground. They're not crawling across your kitchen counter like an ant or a cockroach or buzzing around your head like a fly. So they're really an unseen pest. Well, you know, if, if they're building up a colony for four or five years, what's a homeowner to do if you're not even thinking about that? Are there any telltale signs? The, well, the best thing really, there isn't that many signs other than maybe uh, a creaking weak floorboard or something like that. But, and they don't do a lot of damage. You know, the average eastern subterranean termite colony is eating maybe about four or five board feet of lumber a year. Not to say you can't have one that's bigger or smaller than the others or multiple colonies, colonies attacking your home at the same time. But, you know, Making sure that they're not there, having your home professionally inspected for termite activity, at least on an annual basis, is important. So that's when you really kind of get in there and get an in-depth look at what's going on in your Absolutely. House. You get a trained set of eyes on the situation. Now, you have a new system that you're using? We do. Um, you know, we offer baiting systems. We offer the Centricon baiting system in action, and we do conventional... Uh, type termite jobs over the years you know the amount of termite liquid termiticide we put in the ground to has changed over the years we've gone from these repellent formulations to these non-repellents that the termites can't detect and are a lot more successful but now rather than digging that trench and doing a lot of drilling uh, we're using a system made by BASF it's called the Turbidor high precision injection system and what we're do using on this system is we're actually instead of digging the trench or rotting the termiticide in the soil under high pressure we're injecting it into the ground around your home and one of the benefits to that is no longer do I have to come along and maybe drill holes through your porch or your uh, pool deck unless there happens to be localized termite activity right in that area. That's amazing. So it's really cut down on time. And how about effectiveness? You must like this system it's, really well. Termidor is the number one termiticide and has been for a couple of decades now since they hit the market. So, yes, it is a great labor savings for us as well because we don't have all that backbreaking labor of doing a trench. It's this hydraulic trench process. Is, is there a, a formula that says, all right, you've got this infestation here. Are you... Are you treating a bigger area or do you just treat that one area there? Well, you're, you're treating the home, you're doing this continually treated zone around the home. But where that zone before on other termiticides had to be right up next to the home, meaning we drilled the porches or maybe your pool deck or something abutting the home, now we can just hydraulically trench out around those unless there's localized termite activity there in the foundation or a wall or something. So really the best, the best treatment is prevention. Keeping a, a yearly or how absolutely do you do having having yourself uh, doing just doing an annual inspection is a peace of mind. And if you're not sure that when your home was last treated for you know these termiticides, even the best ones like Termidor, they will break down uh, over time. So you know if after 15 years or so, and depending on your soil uh, pH, they're just breaking those things down. So it's good to you know. If it's been 15, 20 years and you've owned your home, it may be time to get get it treated again. Well, just get it checked out. Scott Robbins and Action Pest can take care of your termite problem and so much more. Thank you, Scott. Thanks, Angie. We'll be back with more Lifestyles right after this. Stay with us. This portion of Lifestyles has been sponsored by Action Pest Control.